this tissue is skin and it's thin skin and we see on the surface a thin layer of non-living uh, protein, the keratin layer, stratum corneum, and then below that the stratum granulosum, cells with uh, purple granules, and then below that the thickest layer of the epidermis, the uh, stratum spinosum, and then down here the stratum basale or stratum germinativum, this first layer of the epidermis. In between the stratum basale cells we see these uh, clear cells or white cells and they are either melanocytes that make the pigment or they're Merkel cells that are mechanoreceptors uh, to, for nervous sensory input through the skin. The next layer down is the dense, irregular connective tissue. We'll go to a lower power. And this is the dermis. And the dermis then will end here. And the deepest layer is hypodermis, composed mostly of adipose and uh, connective tissue. We uh, look in the dermis, we can find uh, in thin skin a hair follicle, and here's the hair follicle, the follicular cells here, and uh, in the center, the hair shaft itself. There's the follicular cells and the hair shaft itself and then adjacent to the hair shaft and uh, capable of pulling the hair into an erectile, erectile position or upwards position is the uh, erectile pili muscle. It's smooth muscle and uh, is situated close to the a hair follicle and we can see this is smooth muscle and also associated with the hair follicle uh, is uh, an oil gland uh, whose, which duct uh, will empty into the hair uh, follicle and uh, follow the shaft to the surface. If we look at the oil gland we'll see that the cells are large uh, and white and filled with vacuoles uh, or granules and these are the oil containing glands uh, cells of the uh, sebaceous or oil gland. We further search in the uh, dermis we will find a sweat gland and uh, this appears to be a sweat gland here uh, it's characterized by uh, the asini or clusters of glandular cells. These would be cuboidal cells uh, forming glands. Here's a sweat gland here and a uh, sweat gland here. And here's the duct, a little darker in color. And there's the lumen of the duct conducting the sweat to the surface of this thin skin tissue. Thank you.